I now call up H.R. 7592 to direct the Librarian of Congress to promote the more cost-effective, efficient, and expanded availability of the annotated Constitution in pocket part supplements by replacing the hardbound versions with digital versions. The clerk will please report the bill. H.R. 7592. Without objection, the first reading of the bill is dispensed with, and the bill is considered read and open for amendment at any point. I now yield five minutes to Ms. Bice to speak on the bill. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, several months ago, CRS asked for the Modernization Subcommittee's help in getting two legislative measures introduced. The first measure, H.R. 7592, will replace the Constitution annotated print requirement with, the digital, with a digital requirement. All four members of the subcommittee agreed movi that moving Conan, as this massive volume is uh, referenced, to a digital-only format was consistent with our broader efforts to modernize CRS. And we all worked together to introduce this bill. Moving Conan to a digital-only format will streamline processes, increase efficiency, and improve the way CRS works on behalf of Congress. It'll also save taxpayer dollars. And the 2022 edition costs $1.25 million to produce, Meanwhile, an online version with real-time updates already exists and has millions of users. I urge my committee colleagues to check out the Conan website. And with that, Mr. Chairman, I yield. The gentlewoman yields back. I now recognize myself for five minutes. When, when I became chair of the Committee on House Administration, some of the goal here was to, to modernize and to save money. Uh, and when you look at this book, that taxpayers are spending a million dollars to produce every time it's produced. And it's immediately outdated when we have a free and available, timely and accurate online alternative. This legislation uh, from Ms. Bice, uh, from Mr. Kilmer, is a no-brainer. We can finally save taxpayers a million dollars every time we do this. There is an alternative. It's more efficient. It's more effective. It's a small step but it's a right step in the right direction to save a million dollars and be more accurate. I'm supportive of the measure. I yield back. Does any other member seek recognition? The question now occurs on ordering H.R. 7592 reported favorably to the House. All those in favor signify by saying aye. Aye. All those opposed, no. In the apparent union of the chairs, the ayes have it, and the motion report is agreed to. Without objection, the motion to reconsider is laid upon the table. I now call